Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one horse. Hey YouTube, what's up? It's Vlogmas Day 4. I've had a really long day and I have something to tell you guys about yesterday night. So as I told you guys, I had an eye doctor appointment where I was going to get my eyes dilated to see if my prescription changed. So yesterday when I spoke to the lady on the phone, she said that my eyes would be dilated for two hours, so plan accordingly. And I said, okay, that's fine. So I planned that between six and eight, I probably won't be able to see much, which I didn't see much. So I was like, okay, so after 8 p.m., that's when I'll study for my AP environmental quiz that I have the next day. So all is well, whatever. And then I get my eyes dilated, and then I asked um, my doctor how long it's going to take. I said, oh, it's going to take two hours, right? And she was just like, two hours? It's going to take minimum four, four and a half hours. And I just kind of <laughs> silently was like, oh, okay, no problem. But on the inside, I was just like, because I planned everything according to after 8 p.m., and then my parents were just like, they're like, why are you making a big deal out of this? Like, I don't get it. And I'm just like, oh my gosh, I have so much to do. So that happened, which was pretty annoying. I was just like, how come, like, how could this lady that works at the office, like, not know how long a dilation is? Like, it's a pretty standard procedure. It's not like it's anything out of the norm, like, two hours. That's pretty, pretty big difference between two hours and four hours. But anyways, that's how my last night went. Pretty, pretty hectic. This morning, the quiz went okay. I mean, we'll just see how it turns out, I guess. I was pretty tired because I couldn't one I had a headache from not being able to see anything it was everything was just blurry and two it's just like Friday it's just been an anticipated day and I just kind of want to sleep and lay down but no I planned that hey after school I'll study for my math for um my math exam on Monday and Tuesday because we have a two-day calculator no calculator test for calc but instead of just studying math and ending my day there my English teacher decides it would be a great idea to assign us all of this extra work due for the next week so we were supposed to have like a bunch of these like literature questions due on monday which you guys saw me doing my previous vlog but in addition to that she thought it would be fun to assign us a take-home test which i'm not complaining about exactly but at the same time i am because not only did she assign us this take-home test which basically means we have to do it perfectly because she's giving us the entire weekend to do it but also typed so it's going to be longer than if you were to just spend like 40 minutes in class doing it and then on Tuesday we have this essay about Hamlet do with all these like different prompts and then on Wednesday we have these literary terms do which like all of these like things and like what do they mean what are these examples of and then Friday and on Thursday we have like basically this whole summary of Sa of Hamlet do which is just weird because like we all we've been doing is Hamlet so I'm pretty sure we all know what the summary of Hamlet is, but it's just like so much unnecessary work and like I have so much to do because tomorrow in the morning I have an interview for a college that I really like in the city and then afterwards I have this gala to go to. I'm really excited for it. Don't think I'm not. Like I am excited, but right now I'm just like, oh my gosh, this weekend. Like it kind of needs to slow down a bit so I can relax and sleep, but no, that's not happening. So yeah, the whole gala is for women's equality and they asked me to do to take like videos there and interview people so i'm excited because i get to use my new canon rebel t6i with this brand new microphone and all these fancy things which is why i'm sitting on the floor because one i needed a break and two i wanted to explore the camera so that way when i'm doing like interviews and stuff tomorrow um i kind of know how to use my camera and don't look like an idiot in front of all these like models and like professional people and important people so gonna work on that later so yeah, now I'm just going to head down to eat some soup, some sushi I think I have. So yeah, it's been a pretty long day, guys. Not going to lie, it's been pretty long. Um, but yeah, so this, I like doing vlogmas because you guys get to really see like the insides of my life, like my day-to-day -day things. Because it's like on camera, it's like I am myself, like don't get me wrong. I talk to you guys the way I talk to my friends, I've said this so many times, but... It's just like you don't see the days where I'm having kind of stressful days. So these vlogs um, will kind of illustrate um, how every day my life is not perfect. And I've never said it has been, but some of you have the impression that I have it all. But it's like, mm. But yes, stay tuned for tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 5, which is going to be a lot more eventful than today's vlog. But hey, it gave you an insight of what my day-to-day -day life is like, which I guess is good. So yeah, it'll be very eventful, so make sure to click back. Make sure to follow me on Instagram, Twitter, YouTube, obviously. And do I have any other social media? That's basically it. Yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow.